Which one? 150 pounds. The return of the spark. The return of the spark. You beat me. You beat me to it. Josh, the Spartan, Stanley. Solid gym, up and coming gym. That's uh, Nathan that's Manis, tough. undefeated professional. Nathan Manis, I really like that guy. I'm just joking. Everybody he's, likes Nathan. Yeah, he's a cool cat. Every time I get on, every time I look on his Facebook to see when he's having fights or whatever, I always date another beautiful girl. <laughs> I'm gonna get into trouble for saying that, but you know what? I don't care. Maybe I'm living in the wrong areas in Kentucky. Uh, the Spartan, the Spartan actually said that. Uh, He's going to finish this fight in the second round by submission. There we go. Accurately, the second round. No more, no less. It's an interesting choice of music. Introducing his opponent fighting out of the red corner. Also weighing at 150 pounds. Representing Guardian MMA from Murfreesboro, Tennessee. This is going to be a tough little fight because Guardian MMA, I mean, they, they proved that they weren't messing around with the other opponent. Now this guy that's coming out the Prince. Greg Cross said he's gonna he's gonna win the fight first round submission. Dig it with me a picture of you and I engaged in a kiss. Ben Sergeant, everybody, he'll be here all week. <laughs> uh, I picture you and I engaged in a kiss. Great cross. Josh Stanley, 150 pound catch weight. It's gonna uh looks like it's gonna be a uh gonna be a tough fight for both of them. Absolutely. Once you get to where they're at in their amateur career, you really don't want easy fights. Especially if you're looking to turn that corner and go professional. Yeah. We got ten and six and uh, four and one. Ooh. Stanley to left hand early. Nice left hook. Kick left hook. Kick yeah. left hook. Good little uh, punch for for Stanley the Spartan. I'm sure he trains a lot with uh, uh, Manus, so he has good training partners. Little slip, little balance off off balance. I gotta tell you, uh, Cross looking tough here early. Yeah, Stanley. Cross needs to uh, keep his hands up a little bit better though. If I were uh, uh, the Spartan, I would uh, go for a left high kick just to see what landed. He slows down a little bit here in the first round. Those kicks are there for the Spartan. It's taking their time, filling each other out, getting that. Every time the Spartan lands, uh, throws something, he lands. So uh, it shows that he needs to keep his hands up a little better. Cross has a good switch kick. Already showing bruising on the uh, on the Spartan or red red marks, rather. Both of their footwork. Very crisp so far. Movement's good. Nice, nice, uh, nice. You switch kick. For it. Yeah, but he had his hand up at the time, so it didn't really. He's setting it up. He is setting it up. He's switching stances, throwing that lead hook. He's gonna come up with that kick. 
Little fancy feet. Don't get too fancy. Nice. Nice, uh, half of little behind the head punch. It's it was still legal, but uh, uh that, that messes up your equilibrium. That's why you saw him like rock a little bit. Now a little cut little cage walk work for uh, both of them. See if this fight goes to the ground or uh, gets broken up again. Good little feet stomp by uh, uh, the Spartan. Ten seconds left to go here in the first round. Solid back and forth so far. Well, he Wrong. just uh, threw him on himself. Good break up for the uh, referee. Once again, our amateur fighters get 90 seconds in between rounds. Is uh, hopefully the Spartan sits down and uh, hopefully Cross sits down. See, uh, make sure they take the proper breathers. These guys are very impressive. I, I like to see uh, talented fighters uh, go at it and, uh, and they test themselves. We'll be right outside the doorway, right there, just across from the ticket booth, right in front of the Hard Rock MMA sign. And get your pictures, little kids and big kids, welcome for picture time with our ring women. We check their IDs. They are old enough to vote. We invite you back. Good little, uh... It's time for round two. Here we go with round two. Round two. Touch the gloves. Doing a little filling out process. Know each other a little bit better. <laughs> Seeing, uh, ooh. Cross comes out strong. Nice left hook. Landed. Plenty of pep in Josh Stanley's step still, but he is. I like those. I like, I like these, these kicks, kicks coming from both of them. Shows dynamics and, uh, that was a little bit of a slip and a power punch, so it's a little mixture of both uh, falling. So more of a uh, nice, nice switch. Goes low. He needs. He really needs to get this double. Yeah, got it. Nice. He needs to keep that. Keep those legs well. We should have kept those legs uh, together. Swims back to the back. Goes into his guard. That's not a good place to be. He really needs to go. He needs to get wrist control. Uh, the Spartan needs to get wrist control on uh, Cross to see. Cross, he needs to, uh, in my opinion, I'd like to uh, pass the guard. Pass his legs and uh, knee on belly. Get, you know. He is going for that arm. Spartan's going for that arm. Uh, what the Spartan needs to do is he needs to, he needs to create space because uh, when you're on the bottom, you need to kill the space, but the guy on top needs to uh, create the space so he can punch or pass, you know, do what he needs to do. Now he's just sitting, relaxing. He needs, to, he needs to be working and getting that arm back out. These guys are more advanced, so they can find something tricky, you know? Stanley kind of getting in a little better position here. Cross still has his arm secured. No danger yet. 
good ground and pound, loosen it up. He loosened up the whole uh, situation that he had there. I tell you what, these guys from uh, uh, Guardian MMA, they're uh, well versed in they have, uh, the ground game. Good little Cross talent them, going on there. Solid on his feet. Stanley, 10 seconds here. Now, this is going into the third round. I like this fight. I could watch this fight all day. Yeah. <laughs> Cardio, not an issue so far. Well, they both look, uh, they, look, they, look, they both look ready to go. How do you know? So what do you think, folks? Too close to call or uh, maybe fight of the night? What do we think? Jason, why don't you get the crowd going? I have it. 20, 18, cross right now. Thank you, Lamb. Very close fight, I believe, but I think Cross will do what he has to do to win the round. Sorry for taking the attention. Green girl looked like she uh, worked her butt off this week. <laughs> her work aside, how do you see the fight right now? It's hard to say, man. I, you know, honestly, uh, he did get those takedowns. Uh, but, but he was in more of a dominant position, uh, actually doing more, uh, trying, trying to finish, to trying to show. I think Cross does some damage. Yeah, yeah, I think, yeah, I think, I think, I think it slightly it goes, goes to. Uh, Greg Cross. Yeah. Well, we've got three minutes left here in this fight. 150 pound catchweight. Greg Cross. Greg Cross and uh, uh, his his team, uh, Guardian MMA, are very impressive. I would Absolutely. I'd like to learn more about them, uh, where they're from. Muffrey's in Merle, Tennessee. Oh, from Tennessee or Tennessee Fighters. Okay. That's why I haven't heard anything from them. Here we go. Round three. Round number three. Touch of gloves. Here we go. Stanley still got a little pep in his step. Cardio not going to be an issue, I don't think, in this third round. Lots of kicks going on here. They're getting at it right away, showing that uh, they both have good cardio. Absolutely. Trading kicks here, left hand. They're, they both have uh, very similar styles. Absolutely. You know? It's all about timing right now. We're back on uh, wall work. We got uh, a Spartan up against the wall this time. Seeing what uh, uh, Greg Cross could uh, uh, muster up if he's going to go for a takedown or if he's just going to pound on him a little bit. This is the round. It's um, it's it's very close to call. So either of them need to uh, make something happen. Regardless of who wins tonight, I, uh, they've uh, they've made fans out of me. I've uh, I think they're both very talented and uh, have a future in MMA. What do you think, Gary? I think the pace slowed down here. I think this is a favor of Cross. I think he's done the damage early. Yeah, you think Cross is a little tired, a little uh, uh, taking a little breather right now, or? He said he's playing it safe, but he's playing it safe right now. Oh, you got the ties of turn with uh, the Spartan. Uh, Sin. Now, the Spartan could steal, the, steal this fight and get a takedown and be on top for... Yeah, this round's really up in the air right now. And this is the round that matters. This is the round that the uh, judges remember, you know? So... Great crowd here tonight at the Sloan Convention Center, Hard Rock MMA 79. We're in the latter part of the third round between 
from Josh Stanley from Tag MMA and Greg Cross from Guardian MMA. Great fight so far. Could be our fight of the night. Yeah, Good I think it's, it's coming. This is for sure fight of the night. Right in front of us here. I think the uh, uh, the cage the cage uh, uh, control is uh, in this fight. I think uh, now when you pull guard, it's really risky. Really risky. Finish the try to round. I want two more. That was really risky going for that uh, pulling the guard in a triangle. He should have done that second round. But he did finish strong. Hopefully the judges knew what the hell he was doing. Let's do That's a scary That's a scary thing. You leave it on what you're watching as a judge. What your biases are, what you know about, what you don't know about. He finished strong, he finished with uh, trying to finish, so that, that goes into play. I'll give the third round of Stanley for sure. Yeah, and then I think uh, round two is up in the air, but round, or round one's up in the air. I think Cross is round two. The judges score the bout 30 27 for your winner by unanimous decision. The red corner, Craig Cross. I don't think I don't it think was a 30-27, but, uh, but uh, <laughs> that's rough to call. I think. Uh, Before we talk to Greg, give it up for both of your warriors tonight, guys. Round two. Round two. I just want to say, these amateurs do not get paid. They have big boy jobs on Monday. So they do this out of the pure passion and the pure hope of going on to the next stage in the career. So anyways, your winner, Greg Cross, what you got? I told the announcer earlier, I think about wrestling, boxing, and jiu-jitsu. I did all those things on one. Fantastic. I guess you could call it. And Brendan Hard Rock, I am ready for the 125 belt. Uh oh, uh oh, oh he should have said, why didn't, hey, there we go, I like that. Jack Cross, why didn't you tell me that? He kept it a surprise, he didn't want to tell, he didn't want to tell me, he wanted to keep it.